good morning dear students welcome to science lesson science lesson 1 unit 1.1 animal skeletons class grade 3 time 45 minutes book students book page 2 and 3 workbook page number 1 and 2 our lesson objectives classification of animals as vertebrates and invertebrates know that humans and some animals have bony skeletons inside their bodies the animal kingdom is divided into two groups they are vertebrates and invertebrates so first we can go to vertebrates vertebrates are animals that have a backbone you can see the backbone here they have a firm body because of the muscles that connect to their skeleton then invertebrates invertebrates are animals that do not have a backbone they have soft inner bodies which are held in shape by a flexible covering of outer cells or by a hard covering called an exoskeleton so children vertebrates mean they are the animals that have a backbone invertebrates mean they are animal that do not have backbone they are having hard covering called exoskeleton then classification of animals as vertebrates and invertebrates here vertebrates with backbones there are two types of classification animals with warm blooded and animals with cold blooded animals with warm blooded examples are mammals birds then animals with cold blooded examples include fish reptiles and amphibians so these are the major five classes of vertebrates classifications mammals birds fish reptiles and amphibians the next one about invertebrates invertebrates means without backbone they are having with jointed legs and without legs so with jointed legs here you can see with three pairs of legs so with three pairs of legs you can see insects then with more than three pairs of legs so these are the two types of classification of invertebrates with jointed legs with three pairs of legs are with more than three pairs of legs the next one is about without legs without legs you can see worm like not worm like so these are the two types of classification without legs so here you can see bear ostrich salmon turtle frog and scorpion earthworm flew leech tapeworm spider cockroach toad crocodile goldfish peacock tiger whale eagle snake uh, ladybird millipede etc so all these comes under vertebrates and invertebrates so let's move to next slide vertebrates vertebrates means animals with a backbone first vertebrates are mammals mammals are animals that have hair are warm blooded and drink milk when they are babies so second type of vertebrates are birds birds are warm blooded have wings feathers a beak and their babies hatch from eggs the next one is reptiles reptiles have scales breathe air are cold blooded and usually lay eggs on land 
The next one is amphibians. Amphibians spend part of their lives in water and part of part on land and they are cold blooded. Examples are given here. Then fish. Fish live in water. They have gills to breathe, scales and fins on their bodies and are cold blooded. Then we can go through the characteristics of vertebrate. Vertebrate characteristics. First one is fish. Fish characteristics are scales, then live in water, cold blooded, lay eggs, gills. Then amphibians, smooth skin, live in water and land, cold blooded, lay eggs. Then reptiles, scales, lay eggs, cold blooded, lungs. Then mammals, hair or fur, warm blooded, live, live birth, live births, lungs. Then birds, feathers, warm bladder, lay eggs, lungs. Then classification of animals as vertebrates and invertebrates. Vertebrates, fish, birds, reptiles, mammals and amphibian. So these are the Five types of classification of animals. Then invertebrates. Invertebrates mean with jointed legs. With jointed legs, you can see three pair of legs. Example insects. Then more than four pair of legs. Example prawn, centipedes. Then four pair of legs. Example spiders. Then without jointed legs. Without jointed legs, you can see segmented body and not segmented body. In segmented body, example, earthworms. And non-segmented body, example, snails. Then vertebrates, animals with backbones. Example, fish, birds, mammals, reptile and amphibians. Next one is missing words. Here you can see one box. Then down you can see some questions. So you have to find the answers from the box. First one, an animal that has a backbone is called a? You have to find the answer from the box. So like that you have to do question number 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 questions are there. Find the answer from the box. Next one, look at the pictures. Circle the vertebrates. So here, here you can see 9 pictures. From these pictures, circle the vertebrates. Next one, label each animal as vertebrates or invertebrates. Please look at these pictures. And find out it is vertebrates or invertebrates. Just type the answer here. It's vertebrates or invertebrates. Then animals without skeleton. Examples are prawn, jellyfish, snail, sea ashen, skewed, fly, cockroach, earthworm, spider, starfish. Next one, animals with bony internal skeleton. Examples include fish, cow, chicken, crocodile. Then, next we are going to learn about what is mean by exoskeleton. So, we learned about animals without skeleton and animals with bony skeleton. Next one, we are going to learn about exoskeleton. Exoskeleton means stiff covering on the outside of some creatures. 
stiff covering on the outside of some creature that we call it as exoskeleton. 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 Body covered with a hard exo, hard external skeleton. So exoskeleton means body covered with a hard external skeleton. Why an exoskeleton? Why not bonds? Exoskeleton good for small things. Protects body from damage. Damages include rainfall, falling, etc. Bonds better for large large things. Then hard external skeleton. So here you can see beetle, that is insect. Then earwig, insect, shrimp, crustacean, spider, arachnid. Then calcium carbonate exoskeleton, snail. It comes under mollusk. Then scallope. It also comes under mollusk. The next one is the activity from workbook page number. One. So question here is, does it have a bony skeleton? Write the name of each animal in the correct column in the table. So here you can see no skeleton, bony internal skeleton, hard external skeleton. Down you can see jellyfish, lizard, clam, frog, spider, crab, hose woodlows, bird and fish. So you have to find out the answers and put it in the correct column. No skeleton, bony internal skeleton or a hard external skeleton. I hope you understand the video. Thank you for listening.